Okay, this video is about these uh, panels that I had uh, done. It's an update to my uh, RGB panels. So this one is uh, started off, basically you see here you can see that uh, this is unpopulated, the LEDs are not put in. And I, as I go along, I fill up the board. In the back it looks like this. Here it, it'll hold the three of the uh, MGP uh, panel decoders. So like I created a little socket here and then plugged them in and then daisy chained them. I have a, ver I have a board with that here. Here you can see the three uh, bo uh, boards from MGP daisy chain. So what happens is now I, this will be an in, in or out. And then this on this side is an in or out. So you can just put the boards in between all the other uh, local net devices on the layout. Then here is five volts that go to a power supply because this requires five volts and a uh, network connection. So what I'll do here is plug in this network connection. Tough to do it one handed. There's one, so that's the end, and then this is another wire that's going to bring a um, local net display. Local net, uh, okay. so that's all working. Put that over. That's an Arduino board. This is a uh, Railcom uh, project. So that's what it looks like lit up. Sorry for the shaky camera. So this is the old RGB uh, LEDs. So I have one panel here, and I have another panel on the other side of the layout which is here on this uh, swivel. I have an arm down here, so I can adjust this. Uh, let's see if this could clear this up. Can I zoom out? Yeah, so these LEDs, they're just a little bit different type. They're much, much uh, nicer. It's maybe hard to see the, the glare. But these LEDs show up better than the other ones. Here there's a roll of yellow, there's a roll of blue. These ones are off. This is telling me that they're it's occupied. So I created this little uh, metal frame for it. And then uh, what I did is I'm bringing it uh, to a network connection here. What I actually did here is um, RJ12 cable is uh, six wires and RJ45 is eight wires. So what I actually did is two of the wires, it might be tough to see here, but two of the wires from the cable go to the power supply for the five volts. So I'm using two of the wires in that cable to come in there, it goes through that jack. Then under the layout here, might be hard to see. I have this, the connector is coming here. RJ45 cable out, but you can see there's two wires here attached to the two of the wires. So this, I'm using a, RJ12 cable to go from there to this little network uh, uh, Digitrax uh, give me the local net signal to that but then the other two wires split off and they come back here and they end up getting wired up into here into the, the 5 volt bus so now instead of having like the other board I have a network connection or RJ45 uh, RJ12 connection and a separate power this one it's all on the, the one cable so uh, this is what it looks like. The night again, better LEDs. Select the roots. If I take the uh, branch line, the branch line are blue LEDs, so they changes a little bit. I'll take this root. So that's all working like it's supposed to. There's LEDs in the track here.